Raffles Hospital Chongqing is our first fully owned and run hospital in China. We have been in China since 2010. We set our first medical center in Shanghai. And a couple of years ago, we think China is right for receiving a more international hospital. China also want to reform their healthcare scene. So there's a lot of opportunity for foreign hospital operator like Raffles. In 2017, Chongqing they invited us to build a tertiary international hospital in the West. We are not only can serve the expatriate population, but also the local communities and the Western provinces, even the Central Asia. When Raffles Medical Group first talked about opening up in China, I think one of the key focus even for them is to make sure the medical practice is a journey that is well thought through. Our input and construction activity for them is to make sure the infrastructure side of things is as seamless as possible. China, there's actually many forms of payments that patients can make, whether it's cash, credit card, to mobile apps, but that increases the complexity for the hospitals to reconcile accounting and settlement at the back end. We've simplified all that for them, but yet provided a useful means for them to be able to still tag each payment to each discipline in an easy and efficient manner. We has 11 medical centers in seven cities in China and Hong Kong. With the opening and running of this Chongqing Hospital, our Shanghai Hospital, and we have planned even to convert uh, our Beijing clinic to a class one hospital. We believe China is big enough for us to even add a few more hospitals. With each market, there are different complexities. The regulatory practices and the environment is very different when you cross from one border to another. If we have been in this market for so long, it puts us in a very unique position to help them and we'll bring the same expertise and knowledge to bear in those solutions that we provided for them. In China, it's not an easy market. Our chairmen always say we have to look after our patient first and the business will take care of itself.